We're in the academic showroom. We have Duck Down in the building. Duck Down. <laughs> Noah from Duck Down. Adrian from Academics. Academics is working with Duck Down this week for the CMJ Music Showcases. Uh, Noah, so tell everybody a little bit about Duck Down, which I'm sure they're already familiar with. Duck Down will be turning 15 years old next year. We're a uh, Manhattan-based uh, independent hip-hop label, home to uh, marquee acts like Kids in the Hall, Blue Scholars, Marco Polo, Torre, Buckshot, Be Real from Cypress Hill, KRS-One, uh, Sky Zoo, yeah, down the line. So there, you know, there's a lot, a lot, a lot of Duck Down artists out there. Um, and aside from just really being a New York brand, we're trying to figure out ways to um, integrate artists across the map. Okay, so Adrian representing academics. Um, where's the brand out right now? Well, right now we're kind of taking academics back to its roots. Uh, when I say roots, I mean going back to our, our, our true fit, what everybody loved, the nice baggier fit from academics. We're taking it back to the more polo, rugby style look keeping everybody fresh and clean for the new season. Because I know the brand has experimented a lot, especially yeah. over recent yeah. years. Yeah. Behind us we have some fall gear that's on sale now on drjays.com. We have holiday coming up very soon. I'm here with kids in the hall with knowledge and double O and still in the academic showroom. Talk to us. We're in town for CMJ mm -hmm. performing. You guys put on a great live show. So, so you've heard? So yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just wanted to make sure. <laughs> now talk to me about you have a tour coming up as well, correct? Yes, we are on tour with uh, you and I and uh, Warren G. We start really soon. Um, we're going to start in New Orleans on the 30th of October, and we rock all the way to Aspen, Colorado, on the 20th of November. So it'll be dope. We'll be pretty much everywhere. We we don't get the chance to hit the West Coast up this time, but we'll get y'all soon. All right. How much time do you spend on your live shows? Um, to be honest with you, we spend more than half the year on the road, so it's like there's not a lot of time for too much rehearsal unless we're putting new songs in. So, you know, we, we try to rehearse and just go over things as much as we can and sound checks and just when we are in the same city, because we actually don't live in the same city. I'm from Chicago and he's from New York. So when we're, at, we're out on the road for the majority of the time, so it doesn't feel like that. But I've known him since 2000, so we've been working on the show for a long time. So what's the difference between a Chicago crowd and a New York crowd? Mm. Movement. Yeah, the, the Chicago crowd. Yeah. If they like it, they act like they like it. People, people in New York, man, they just stare at you, and then you go to the bar, and they'll be like, "Yo, great show!" I'm like, "Yo, why didn't you <laughs> let me know that while I was on stage?" Okay, so upcoming rappers, make sure you take note of that. Yeah, don't worry <laughs> if if you just get the stone face. It's harsh. If they don't walk to the bar during your set, then you're cool. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> the tour is coming up. The album's coming up early next year. Land of Make Believe. Where can we find you online? Um, www.kidsinthehall.com. Follow us on Twitter at Kids in the Hall or at Double O Kids. Kids with a Z. Kids, kids with yes, a Z. K I D Z. Boss Lady now here with Torre of Marco Polo and Torre fame. Yeah. There's a whole crop of New York MCs that are making quality music right now. Yourself, Mr. Meg, Shah Stimuli, Donnie Goins, Amelia. There's like so many names. Definitely. And the music isn't too different to the music that you grew up on, like Wu-Tang, the actual quality of the music, right. and people are still listening to the old Wu-Tang hits. Why do you think it's taken so long for the, the mainstream, the wider hip-hop community to embrace these New York MCs? Um, I don't know, that's a really great question. I think that um, people that listen to music from that era are kind of just stuck on the artists from that era. You know, and, and a lot of those artists are still making music, you know. Um, Jay-Z just got a new album, Rick Warren's got a new album. So a lot of artists that, you know, they love from that golden era are still putting out music. So it's just been harder for new artists, you know, with that same type of feel or approach to kind of break in because, you know, you're kind of trying to occupy the same space almost. Well, speaking of which, you're going out on tour soon, right, Tori? Yeah, yeah, no doubt. Um, we're about to head back to Europe. You know, that's that's my spot. That's my bread and butter over there in Europe. Europe's so the spot? No doubt. I love Europe. Love Most Europe. rappers. I do love Europe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love I love going out and seeing you know different places and people and um you know so check for the tour um it's gonna be myself uh, Superstition aka Cam Moy and Rapper Pool Little Brother so you know coming to a city near you. All right, thank you so much. Big Thanks shout out to everyone that supported Double Barrel. No doubt. And if you don't have it, you know what to do. You know what I mean, hit this record store, hit the iTunes or whatever, whatever, whatever. You get in tune with the Double Barrel album. Shout out to Marco Polo, Dug Down Records, Academics, and DrJ's.com. Boss Lady here now with Sky Zoo. Yeah.
the year. How would you describe yourself as part of Duck Down? Like, what role do you play in the label? Um, with me, my sound is, you know, real New York based, but beyond that, it's relatable to everywhere, you know, everywhere else, you know. So with me, it's a lot of storytelling. Lyrically, people know I do that, but then with the album in particular, a lot of storytelling, a lot of paint pictures and all that. I feel like my album is different from what else is on Duck Down, as well as everyone else. I think we all bring our own piece to the puzzle, so it but makes sense. But you're different stories, are you saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah okay, sure. so the album, speaking of which is called The Salvation, so you're on every Everybody's radar, including Ghostface, who you're about to go on tour with, which yeah. is a huge, huge thing. So yeah, talk yeah. about that. Where are you going to be? Uh, we're going to be up and down the U.S., you know, starting in the West Coast and like Denver, and Aspen and all that, and then just going through the Midwest and hitting the East Coast dates and everything. So it's going to be real dope. Did you look up to Ghostface coming up? Yeah, he's definitely somebody that I came up listening to, you know, being in high school, copping Iron Man and all that. I remember that, you know what I mean? So to be able to jump on this tour and be able to be a part of it and, and set the tone for when he come out is dope. So now you grew up with Ghostface, did you grow up rocking academics at all? Did you wear the academics jeans when you yeah, were coming yeah, up? Yeah, yeah, no, nah, definitely. I remember when academics popped, like when it became, you know, it came out the gate out of nowhere and it became that new thing and, you know, everybody latched on to it. Do you remember it. the street uh, yeah. campaign they had? Yeah. Like, give good brain and like it was Yeah, crazy. yeah, yeah, it was that? dope, dope. And, and what stuck out to me the most too was when they did the Wire campaign because I'm a huge Wire fan. So when they did the Wire campaign, that hit home too. Right. Okay, well, you're looking good in the brand. I'm sure they're taking appreciate care it, of you. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Where can we find you online? MySpace.com slash SkyZoo, Twitter.com slash The Real SkyZoo, and just Google me. I'm all over. Are you I'm like Tour? Are you, are you on Twitter all the time? No, nah, I'm not like Tour. I'm not on Twitter all the time, but I'm on it enough. I, I let people know where I'm at, what I'm doing, and the whole deal, and that's that. So, okay, you know. all right. Thank you so much. Thank you. Can't nobody get it like me. Come on. Yeah, my popularity is sky high. The most popular of all when I ride by.